Let's check our iOS 12 and there's a USDZ file in various Apple apps. You can attach a USDZ file to a note in Notes app. Then all you need to do is just tap on the file icon in the note to open it in a quick look viewer. The USDZ file can be saved in Files app and iOS recognizes it as such and mark it with a relevant icon. Now just tap it once and you can see that iOS 12 opens it in quick look viewer. Very simple. I've created a link to the USDZ file on my blog. Safari recognizes this link because of the rail AR property on the link and the specified model slash USD content type header. One tap and the 3D object is opened in AR Quick Look. By default, it is opened in Object View, but you can view it in AR as well, of course. So just click the AR button at the top of the screen to view the object in augmented reality. This is a USDZ file I made to award developers of Editor's Choice apps. After all, what's a better way to award an AR app than give it an award that renders in augmented reality? The USDZ file is also recognized by Apple Mail app. I send an email to myself and attach the USDZ file as an attachment and send it. The reception, in this case myself, uh, I tapped the file to download it and I always recognized it and the file opens in Air Quick Look. Here you can see a template 3D scene that I used uh, in uh, Vectory, Vectory.com. I just changed it a bit, add a few images, and then export it as a USDZ file and view it on my device, my iPad. I'm sure Apple will add uh, USDZ file support for other apps. Uh, anyway, it was fun experimenting with it. Thank you for watching and I see you on the next video. Bye.